Hi, this is Ross with My Service Depot, and today we're going to go over how to set up your inventory using Smart Service. Now, to gain access to the inventory, we're going to come over to the office icon. From there, we're going to click on inventory down at the bottom. Now, when we click in here, this will show you all your different locations and all the different items you have set up per location. Now, your first initial setup is up here to the top right, set up locations. Now, this is where you create all your different trucks, all your different warehouses in Smart Service. So, all you do is come down to the bottom. You can associate a employee or just type in a new location name. We're going to do truck five. You then select a location type, truck or warehouse. You then assign that to a user. This one's going to be for Steve, Steve T. And once you're done, you do click the X to the top right. Now, once you actually set up the location, we're going to come to the second step, edit on hand quantity. Now, this is where you set up each location, each item, and what they have on hand per location. So, we're going to come down all the way to the bottom and select our blank. So we're going to set up truck 5 in its inventory. Select truck 5. Come to the next box in our name and select the inventory item. So we're going to have 12 to Romex wire. And then truck 5, he has already 500 feet. And you continue. Come down, we'll select truck 5 again and start adding all the different individual items he has in that truck. 13 by 13 cap. He has five of those. Let's do one more. Add the thermostat, and he has two of those. So again, once you're done with your location and it's on hand quantity, you click the X up to the top right. Your last step is click restock point. This is where you have the ability to set up restock points when you get below a certain quantity. So we're gonna come down to the blank box again, select truck five, and we're gonna select our inventory for Romex wire. So what's great about this is say when he gets below 100 quantity, it will now create us a restock reminder to order more wire for that truck. So again, once you're done, click the X. Now to the left, you can see we have our truck five set up. You can see our inventory item, how much we have on hand. The second column will show you how much is on a work order and then what's available. And then to the right, you can see our restock point. So when it does get below 100 quantity, it will create your restock point to order more of this wire for that vehicle. And it's that quick and easy to be able to keep track of inventory for several different locations using Smart Service. Now, for more info, go to smartservice.com or follow us on Facebook and Twitter with the links below.